Wrexham is an old market town in North Wales, on the border of England. It's been rumoured by the public that below Wrexham is a network of underground tunnels. Members from a Facebook group, Old and New Photos of Wrexham, shared photographs of these tunnels to North Wales Live. Within their article, they explain how the Wrexham Council deny any existence of these tunnels, despite there being evidence from the public. Whether it's rumour or not, it's a long-standing thing. These tunnels have been found to link together underneath the iconic parish church. Many pubs and bars in the area have reported entrances to these tunnels in their basements. Although there is no official public documents regarding these tunnels, an old legend suggests they were once used by the priests of the parish church to sneak to the pubs and back hundreds of years ago. Whether or not this is true, the parish church dismisses this theory saying there is no tunnels or entrances on church grounds. Sorry to disappoint you. Yeah. Yeah. Complete fiction. However, the majority of the public have reasons to believe the church are in denial. Join us on our most ambitious adventure to uncover the truth and find the rumoured underground of Wrexham. Our journey starts at the Golden Lion, a pub based on Wrexham High Street, which supposedly has potential access to the tunnels, according to North Wales Live. We pre-arranged an off-camera chat with the manager who kindly agreed to let us investigate. So was it you that found, the, found these, uh, this trap door? No, not really. It's, uh, it's always been here. Oh, you go, 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 go the other side, go that side there. Just yeah. and, and against the wall, yeah? Sure. Oh, that's crazy. <coughs> We're there, two checks. That's tight, isn't it? There's a light there, if you want it. I got a bit torture. Is there a light, is there? Yeah, it's a big work light. Yeah, that, that'll light up the racks of that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to go down the other way, do I? Backwards. When I fall down, I fall down, you don't have to. I think I'll need for the easy bit. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Do you want to go the next switch? Yeah. Film you going now. There's not a noise for sharks. Yeah. It's the scary noise of one, wasn't it? No, you could have come up with something like Psycho or something. All sad coming up from there, and I'm going to start to worry. That's mad, that is. It's crazy, just read this on mine, that. That's crazy. Right. It's it's have a quick nose. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, there's an actual tunnel running through there. Yeah, that's that's that's, that's the breeze block, but the breeze block is just only because of road and things. Yeah, breeze. yeah. Shit. Take your time, don't fall. <laughs> that's crazy. Do you know when that got bricked up? Been done for years, I think. Done for years. I've been here six years, and that's always been an hour. I've always said I'm going to take it down and I'll take, well, take so many and go and have a look. You're in. Yeah, yeah. It is evident that there once used to be access to the network of tunnels under the Golden Lion. Unfortunately, the entrance had been bricked off years ago for safety concerns with the road right above it. That's the floor upstairs here. Oh, when you were, is that when you found out about this? Or? Yeah, because they did all the work in here. They all the is brand new. Oh, wow. That's where we are now. Oh, wow. So when did you discover about the tunnel? Didn't well, we didn't even know until it, it was until it got investigated. The thing, like, oh my god, that's the hole there. It was all rotten. All this was yeah. It was all like white stuff. Do you know what they were for? There's like loads of theories about them. Priests, yeah. somebody, priests coming yeah. to the pubs. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. That's what they say, like. Steps in there too. Maybe that went like right up into the pub. I'm guessing. Yeah, I, I got, I've got a, another cellar down there. Oh, yeah. Well, but it's full of junk, all my junk. That's <laughs> a bit embarrassing, but, but there's most probably tunnels there. You can see, you can see arches. Oh. Oh. 
The owner also showed us some old steps that led down to another basement behind the bar. He explained that supposedly one of the steps are bigger than the rest, which were designed intentionally to trip up the priest. Is that a tip of you? No, it is. Trust me. It's crazy, this, isn't it? Yeah. You got your lights, yeah? Because I've got your lights, yeah. So I don't know if there was tunnels in the other one. I don't know, yeah. I'm going to get tip, look at it. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> it's, it's all got to go to the skip. So I don't know if there was tunnels in the other one, I don't really know, you mean? Yeah, yeah. But it's old, isn't it? Yeah. And damp. Um, Although there were no obvious tunnel entrances in the cellar, the arched ceiling was just as old as the tunnel entrance we had seen, which means they were built in a similar time date. Yeah. There you go. Thanks for that, man. Thank you. You're alright. You're alright. <laughs> this is brilliant. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> We're a fraction from there. Should we just take a light? Yeah. We're going to go back in my cellar and we'll be bound. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. We've got to go exploring for these tunnels, haven't we? Yeah. I thought it was that initially when we walked in. Yeah. That was our first attempt to go again in the tunnels, so we're uh, going to try and see if there's actually any other ways in. And uh, yeah, there's a good mine pub right there. It was clear that the pubs near the church contained entrances. We went to several pubs in the area who all had the same bricked off entrances within their basements. Many of the owners supported that the tunnels connect under St. Giles, where some completely disregard and suspect that they are just sewers. So, from what Alex just told us, he's, he's like, oh, it could be just old drain pipes, but... Alex is the manager of yeah. the, the, uh, the, the bank, bank here in Wrexham. But, you know, like like we saw in the nag's head, it's like it's an actual, like, it's a tunnel, it's an archway. Yeah. And if, it, if that was like a sewage, but like, yeah, fair enough, pipes can run through it, but it's still, it's massive. Plus, why would a pub have like a big sewage pipe opening in their basement? There is very little information regarding the tunnels online. However, we did find Old Wrexham Tunnel Forums. The community said that there is potential tunnels underneath the butcher's market. We headed there to speak to shopkeepers and the butchers to find some pretty amazing evidence. Yeah, there's well, there's, there is tunnels, you know, in the butcher's market across the road. Yeah. There's actually an entrance there to one of the tunnels. Really? Yes. So you know about these tunnels yeah. as well? Yeah, 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 yeah. We've been around a few pubs and they're saying that uh, there is there is tunnels but it's all been bricked off. The I, Golden Lion took us down one of them but it, it's bricked off as well. I, I tell you the truth, I mean, I don't know how far they, they will extend. I heard that from the miners, you know, the miners institute in Wrexham, oh, okay. which is now the Wrexham Moss, there's tunnels there as well. Tunnels there? Yeah, and I don't know how far they extend, but I was yeah. told that they extend pretty far, to be honest with you. Oh, wow. Apparently they all link up to the parish church, but they've denied Maybe. it. When we went in. Well, there was a programme about the history of Wales mm. and there was a small section about Wrexham that they, uh, apparently they used to send all the delinquents up to Wrexham and there they mentioned the tunnels underneath the Paddish Church. Really? So there is definitely something there. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe yeah. we can find that on the internet somewhere. You, yeah. I can't remember the name of the programme. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. The, uh, to be honest with you, it's. Whether it's a rumour or not, it's a long-standing thing. Yeah, yeah. And I think it's more than just a rumour, you know. But you might have a word with the people in the butcher's market. Yeah. Have a word with some of the... If you go to the butcher's stalls... Yeah. They've been there usually the longest. Yeah. They might be able to point in the right direction. Okay. There's one that goes to the very end, just before the high street entrance, on your right-hand side. They've been there a long time. Really? And I can pretty much guarantee they'll tell you more. Yeah. Yeah. some case already. Years ago, when I first started here, this was all done out of with shells. And Mr. Pugh, who had a shop opposite me, he used to uh, put all his tin stuff down here. You know? Oh, really? Yeah. Now, that's and see, it was open 
two a year. Oh really? And then I could stand on boxes and, and look, look in, but it was yeah. just black, you know. Yeah. But what happened was, when they were doing the high streets outside, they were uh, resurfacing it all, they were digging down, so I went across to the JCB man and I said, do you realise now, I said, there's tunnels under where you are now, and I said, I can stand up in them. So I said, you must be very, very close to these tunnels. Well, they, yeah. know, they know what they're doing. As soon as I walked in the shop, I heard a commotion and the JCB fell through it. Really? Oh so then they had to fill it all up with stone so that now it's knackered there, you'll never... Yeah, yeah. And then... Uh... Oh, yeah. And then there's an air raid shelter down there. There's an air raid shelter down there? Yeah. That's crazy too, you know? <laughs> We'll be lucky if this battery keeps going. Yeah. Creepy. <laughs> yeah, so the There's the, uh, the shelter. That's oh the my shelter. god! That's oh the old side. There's some history out there. And that, is that the shelter in there, is it? Yeah, I think so. It was in the year. Oh my god. Wow. This is all. Yeah, they could do so much with it if they wanted to, couldn't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, they could, yeah. I don't know what that was. I take it they might have been toilets or something. Oh yeah, toilets, yeah. Box something like that, don't they? There's some, is that like some old electric stuff there, is it? Yeah. That, you'd be underneath now, uh, you think where you are. You'd be underneath the, ta the sunbed, sunbed shop. Yeah. Can you? Yeah, I can. Can you hear yeah. the Golden Lane? Oh, is that that, is it? I think that's a Golden Lane pub, I think, yeah. Oh my God, yeah. That's crazy. That's yeah. so interesting. See all the old tucks hanging, yeah. hanging bacon off. <laughs> oh my god. So do you reckon that went through over there with it? Uh, I'm not there? sure. I, I've never known that to be open. Uh, I would imagine that it was like would have had bars on it or something somewhere, wouldn't it? Yeah. The accent's full of tunnels, isn't it? It's just that they're not. They seem to keep it quiet. I don't know why. Yeah. Apparently the council deny all these tunnels are successed, really? yeah. I suppose it's to like stop people from going down there, but yeah. still it's like an interesting piece of history. Of course it is. You shouldn't really keep it a secret. Yeah. Wow. I'll let I like go through first. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's a, that leads to the back of the Gordon Lane. Oh, does it? Yeah, you can pick up, up some steps. All oh, right. Didn't realise we are that close to me. We just gone down there. We have the uh, the manager let us uh, go gents, down. Gents. Down where? Down the. Oh, yeah, there's like a trap the, door. They the let cellar. us go into. Oh yeah, into the into the salon of. Uh... Let's take a... yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? How much history there is in that song. Oh yeah. yeah. I didn't realise there was a <laughs> air raid shuttle down here. Oh, thanks for that, mate. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, back, back in the uh, early 80s, they, you had the mayor and that down the end, they opened this up. Oh, did they? Yeah, because they thought that was a tunnel. Oh, they thought that was a tunnel, then, Yeah, when they? they opened it up, it just a load of suck come out, they reckon. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> so people have actually looked for these tunnels. Have you seen this stuff? 25 years ago, Danny? It was totally different. It was all lit up. Uh, Mr. Pugh, the old man, he used to, uh, he used to have his uh, office in here. The funny thing was, right, was he was sitting down here the day of the JCB. Oh, really? Uh, the road. So he was sitting in there. He used to listen to the wireless. Uh, he had his butties down here. And he, just, <laughs> he, got, he stared at that wall for 60 odd years. And suddenly, because that JCB went through, a shaft of light come through. And he thought he died because he was in his 80s. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. My oh, God. I've heard of Mr. Pugh. Yeah, I'll show you a picture of him. Yeah, i got a picture of him upstairs. Yeah, it was his down here. This is where he... Uh, He's a marvelous fellow, he loves it. And then this just goes down to... Oh, wow, that's crazy. This is nothing really now, it's just... I've never known this to go anywhere. But that'd be bricks, so that would have gone... Oh, on. yeah, yeah. That would have gone on real long, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's crazy, that. It's so interesting. Yeah. It really is a shame that the council can buy it. Yeah. I don't know why you like it. <laughs> they've, got, they've got no vision, have they? No, no, no they haven't, they haven't. They haven't, honestly. Look at that old generator there. It's an old uh, fridge motor. Oh, is it a fridge yeah. motor, is it? <laughs> so I've been to this market so much, didn't realise what this was done here. Yeah, it's mad, isn't it? Mm. 
The tunnels supposedly connect under St. Giles Church. We headed there to inquire and find out more information in regards to the tunnels. Hello. Hello, hiya. Um, we're two film students. Uh, we're originally from Wrexham, but we're in Manchester at the moment. Yeah. And we're doing a bit of a short film on the, the hidden history of Wrexham. Yeah. And um, we've heard that there's a big part of, you know, the church, like, it, it, the tunnels That's underground. Good. Yeah, no worries. Okay, no problem. Oh, hello. Hiya. My name's Jordan and this is uh, Rachel. Hello. Hiya. Uh, we're two film production students from Manchester. We're right. originally from Wrexham. Right. And uh, we heard somewhere about some tunnels, underground tunnels. Oh, look, sorry to t disappoint no. you. Yeah. Complete f fiction. Yeah. I mean, there have been people after these, we, we, we've had endless stories, but no, we know that there is nothing coming into this church, that's yeah. for definitely sure. Yeah. There, there is talk about some of the pubs, reckon the yeah. tunnels have been blocked off, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And uh, the fanciful idea is that there's been some connection here as a place of refuge. Yeah. There is absolutely no evidence for it at all. Sorry. No, no, no worries. We're just, we're just asking. We're just mm, interested yeah. in it. We just went down a pub cellar now and they said there were some tunnels and we mm, just mm. filmed it. Yeah, we've just been into the parish church in uh, Wrexham here as we're walking past it. Uh, we did query about these uh, so-called tunnels and uh, they uh, apparently, they, they don't believe in it, but yeah, I feel like... In her words, complete fiction. She thinks it's complete fiction. I'm not sure how much of that I recorded. I think you'll probably hear a lot of video, audio, and uh, not a lot of video stuff, but... I'm not convinced, you know. I think they're saying that because... They don't want they people don't... coming in and wondering about... Yeah, I think it's not only that, but I feel like... You know, because they're church people and they believe in yes. this church massively, they don't want to believe that their vicars or priests hundreds of years ago were sneaking off to pubs underground they're not going to support the uh <laughs> they're not going to support the tunnels lead here but there's so much evidence against it at the moment uh we're just having a quick uh walk around on the uh, church grounds now to see if there's anything Any unusual videos? about the grounds we're not archaeologists but we know a tunnel when we see one <laughs> we so see. I don't know, there's something about this place that just it, it's telling me there's tunnels under there. It's been a full year since our pre-investigation and we're now heading back to Wrexham to explore a potential tunnel underneath Brook Street. We put our wellies on and began filming. I apologise for the raw audio as our microphone was broken at the time. Thank you. Much appreciated. I'm trying to be quiet because uh, public roads by here, if you live in Wrexham, <laughs> you know this is a very busy road. I think it gets shallower when we actually get to the tunnel here, so... Here we go. So far, we've only found some old pipes. God, my bastard back's hurting. <laughs> Sorry for the language. <laughs> oh, there's a wall on the other side of that. Sorry, I'm going to move the, the light here, see? Oh, fuck. And then there's concrete, so... That's weird. Right, we'll just sit, uh, we just found a little dry spot here just to frickin' get our bikes back straight because, honestly, we're so crouched inside this tunnel right now that our it's backs... It's a straight, we have to walk through like this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can hear us right now because our microphone is not here, like I told you. No signs of tunnels, just a stream at the moment with some pipe on the side and it seems to have gotten shallower and there's a good sign that there, there obviously hasn't been a lot of rushing water through here recently so I think we're alright, I don't want to jinx us but I don't think we're going to drown today uh, we'll, we'll continue forward and uh, see if there's any evidence of tunnels obviously we're in a tunnel now but hmm. Oh, 
close a manhole there. Oh, I'm going to take a minute to use that. Oh, spider's nest galore in here though. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that had me that. That's what the cars are going over. Just a pallet there. No sign of any alleyways or stairs or nothing. I'm convinced this tunnel is uh, just a speculation so far. I'm sweating. I am too. I'm sweating, honestly. <laughs> right, that's the end of that tunnel. Unfortunately, there's nothing there. I was expecting to find maybe some entranceways to other tunnels, but who knows? I don't know exactly where we are now. I think we're near Island Green. We've gone halfway through, well, half a mile down the tunnel. We need to keep looking. She's absolutely shattered. <laughs> I'm sweating, like it's um, the 1st of September today. You'll probably be seeing this video October, so uh, yeah. Good news. Yeah. Bad news. It's very deep. Is it very deep, is it? Oh yeah, it's very murky in there. It's probably because it's so still, isn't it? Oh I'm gonna get me bloody fucking I'm already wet to be honest. Hold that. That kind of bends round. I think we'd have to do that in a boat of some kind, to be honest. Damn. You know what that means then, don't you? Back through the tunnel. Back through the tunnel. <laughs> so, in terms of the tunnels, um, I don't know what to think so far. We went down that tunnel, and in my full opinion, I think it was an old drain pipe myself. Um, however, the tunnel we didn't go down, the other tunnel on the other side, which you'd just seen, uh, the water was too high for our wellies, and we'd need something like waders, or even like a dinghy, which we do have. So if, so if you guys are interested in a part two of this video, we'll make this into a series and do some more investigating, and go down that tunnel with a dinghy. The water height was just a bit too tall for our liking, due to how murky it was. Uh, the could be anything over there there could be a massive hole and if we were to drop down that hole our oh, sorry asses would be sorry <laughs> um but yeah if you guys enjoyed the video please support us we're a brand new channel here on youtube we've been going about a year and uh we've had some amazing support this is all about urban exploration and recovering history and to find some history from my hometown is really amazing so if you guys want a part two we'll, we will definitely go back into this and uh, we will continue where we left off but for now that is our investigation of this place uh, in terms of conclusion we haven't got one yet we're going to continue this upon request um, but really interesting it really is and uh, to see if these tunnels do connect under the parish church we'll have to find out in part two but anyway guys Make sure you're subscribing and clicking the notification bell because that will keep you updated with all our videos. And if you're interested in this series, you do not want to miss out on that. Thank you for watching, guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.